Hello, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, where we have got a shrine to go into. So let's go into this shrine, where we are almost certainly getting bombs or something similar. Though the old man wants us to bring him the treasures from inside the shrines, unless we can give him the soul orbs. I'm not sure what he's talking about. Okay, yeah, we're we're getting the ability to blow things up. Hi, Jabaj. Um, yes, I do believe we are in fact getting bombs here. Something about this place just tells me that. Liquid bombs? Are our bombs going to be a rune? Whoa there. Two kinds of bombs? Round and cube. I guess for if I want to roll them or have them just sit where they land. So let's try a cube bomb. That was the wrong button. Okay. Wrong button. Um, it's nice that they are remote controlled though. Do, do you do anything? You're just there to provide light? So apparently we have infinite bombs and they're just on a timer. Yeah, looks like it. That's actually kind of neat. I kind of wish they would do the same with regular arrows because... Yeah, I, I don't have many. Do you want to give me arrows? Well, I mean, that's nice. But it's... Wait, what? I can't carry very many weapons, can I? Let's get rid of the stick. Okay, so it's not a bad idea to use our weapons until they break just to keep our inventory cycling, is what I'm gathering from this. Ooh. Okay, so we get to have our bombs ride that, but probably best if we don't ride it ourselves so that we don't explode when we do that. Because, yeah, these explode with a pretty large radius, by the look of things. Ooh. This seems fun. Okay, so it looks like we drop a round bomb in here, it gets launched, and then we explode it. That is the wrong button. It's going to take a while to get used to these controls. They are very different from any previous Zelda game. Boom! Looks like it may be worth doing that again, but I'll wait. There is a ladder after all. So, this one was just here to show us what's what, I guess. So, is this one here to launch me over to that chest? Let's see. It sure is. Hello, chest.
It occurs to me there might have been a second chest in the last shrine, maybe like in the in the water portion, maybe there was a chest hiding that I could have used magnets to get out. Can I not climb this at all? Guess not. So, boom! And looks like we are done with this trial. Hello. Want to give me your soul orb thing? Does it? Spirit orb. That's what it was. Thanks. Ooh, can I use bombs on the guardians? Okay, bye. The fancy, like, energy arrows that Link used in the first trailer against a guardian. Are those going to be a rune, or are they just going to be a different kind of arrow, I wonder? For some reason, the presence of guardians is making me think of these things. That was the wrong direction, but that's okay. Cooldown's a little bit long for my liking. Come on, that totally should have exploded these rocks. It was close enough. There, how about this? If this doesn't blow him up... Okay. Um, Link, I didn't want to climb the wall. I appreciate that you're enthusiastic. But maybe, maybe save it for later. Ooh. That was close. Um, still on cooldown. No, I, I'm not here. Don't, don't look at me. That didn't really do anything. Whoa there, you didn't even... Yep. What's your deal, dude? What caused that explosion? Was it the Guardian? <laughs> yeah, it was the Guardian. Seems they uh, only do that sighting up thing if it's not a retaliatory strike. I don't think I have the firepower to actually bring this thing down, especially because the bombs don't seem to be actually doing much. Is it because of my distance to the target, or are... Th are they not getting where they need to be? Yeah, it looks like it's probably they're not getting where they need to be, which means if we get here, maybe if we uh, try from a little bit closer. I'm worried that wall might not hold out. I'm also worried I'll get bored and leave. Yeah, that is a little intimidating. Round bombs were getting us better results, though. Yeah, it seems we can throw them farther.
Hmm. Yeah, I don't seem to be putting a dent in this. Like, even if I explode it right in front of the eye like that. So, how were we able to do some damage and not able to do any more since? How did I able to ruin grammar? Link, come on. Just because something is climbable doesn't mean I want you to climb it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this one? Yeah, that one's also going to wake up. Let's... Let's go in here. Okay, now I want you to climb it, Link. Okay. I do believe we have successfully escaped. 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 Oh! I can crouch. Oh yeah, that dramatically reduces the amount of noise I make while moving. So let's... Wander along. Okay, we can't really go far this way. Um, how can I? Can I just run up this? Seems like it should be too steep for that, but guess not. Ooh, I spy an enemy of some sort. Wow, the frame rate is really dropping around here. Especially when I turn the camera. Okay, we've got a little camp there. Maybe I can give them a present. That's the wrong button. I want moving and hitting A to B to throw a bomb, just like it used to be. Oh, that is not as lethal as I had hoped. Oh, it wasn't a plus way back when, when I got a new sword or whatever. It was a right arrow showing that, like, it was a side grade. Can I take this arrow off of my shield? I kind of want it. <laughs> uh. What's sparkling over here? Oh. But seriously, can I take this arrow off my shield? Maybe if I swap my shield. Nope. I was kind of hoping that would result in the uh, arrow dropping at my feet. But it did not. I feel like if I get rid of this... I'm going to regret it. But let's see what happens. Oh yeah, they're coming for me. So, let's light this on fire. Yeah. And now, ooh. Ooh. Can I cook at this fire? Can I cook at any fire? Is that an ability that gets unlocked later? I have a feeling that X, Y, and B will get things put on them later. Hmm. I see sparklies? I do. Also, what's with the fireflies? Can I sneak up on fireflies and grab them? Or are they just here for ambience? Ooh, I can grab them. Though this one seems a bit too high up. Okay, I'm actually not certain what the icon above the noise meter is. Jumping for apples. I don't need more apples. So what have we got a shining on here? Looks like a type of mushroom. Mushroom. 
Okay. And looks like another. Looks like another little camp of enemies. More fireflies. Something a glowing in there. Oh. Okay. Looks like I could grab a rake or pitchfork or whatever that is. Anyone in here? Nobody. Oh, old man. Is this your house? I know it's late, but hi. Uh, sleeping. But, oh. Hope you don't mind if I steal your stuff. Oh. Ooh, what's this book? I mean, it's open. On this desolate plateau, the only pleasure that brings me comfort is cooking. And today I outdid myself. Truly, I created the perfect dish. I call it spicy meat and seafood fry. Not only restores health, but it also keeps me warm even when traveling in the snowy mountains. Okay. Oh, forgot to write down an important recipe. Raw meat, spicy pepper. Oh, but there was also something else. Oh. oh. Okay. So they want me to try and figure out what else to add to raw meat and the spicy pepper in order to complete the, uh, oh, a new shield. Okay, it's not a good one. So if, if I complete the recipe, then I get a thing. Let's sit around till morning and then talk to the old man. Maybe he'll teach us to cook. Because it seems he and cooking are related. Old man? Old, old man? He told me to talk to him in the morning and now he's gone. I feel betrayed. So that's fine. Okay, there is a chest to be gotten here. That's the wrong button. There we go. We've got one arrow. Got to make it count. It did not count. For, well, I mean, we can. That's wrong. Uh, this. This feels a little wasteful, though. That felt really wasteful, actually. Okay, club broke. That's That's actually good for us. Let's break this one, too. Ow. Can I dodge? Ooh, I can parry, apparently. Uh, still got the club, though. There we go. Broke another club. And someone's peppering arrows at us. That was close. Please, keep giving me arrows. Okay, let's swap these before it's too late. Five arrows from that guy. 
Yeah, let's not shoot him. He's on the ground. Can't carry any more horns? Oh no, can't carry any more bows. So let's see what kind of loot these guys were guarding. Neato. That looks like an entrance to somewhere that they were trying to block off. Oh, it's an entrance to bees. Well, let's just put that right there. Um, bomb, no, don't chase me. Wrong button. And that is why they invented cube bombs. Oh, hey, got rid of the bees. A lot of shrooms. And what have we here? Ooh. I bet those would be good against guardians. So we want to be going in a kind of this way direction. Yeah. Looks like we're gonna need... Oh, there's the old man. Yeah, we're gonna need to bridge the gap here. Link doesn't jump very well. Yeah, what are you doing? Okay. Mmm. Is that so? I didn't find your axe. I found some completely other axe. So point your waist in the direction you want the tree to fall. So basically face the direction you want it to go. Yep, face the direction you want it to go. So, if we face this way... No, Link. Face this way and go a-chopping. Then we get a bridge. Hopefully a bridge that'll stay put. Let's get a second bridge. Just to be safe. Ooh. Neat. But I can't carry it. So let's get rid of some things. Like the Boko Clubs. They break too fast and they are less potent than the Traveler's Swords. Not much need for them. Korok Leaf, I can see some uses for. And I guess the axe can cut down trees, so it's worth keeping. Looks like this will have a slow swing. Yeah. So let's just use the Traveler's Swords for now. No, don't push it, Link. You want to walk across it. That's a long way down. Let's not fall down then. Okay, we've got one lookout, two lookouts, two lookouts. Nothing else of interest over there. So let's swap over to round bombs. Got him. Uh, mostly. 
Wow, dude, you've got a stick way longer than my sword. You could have stabbed me so many times. Wow, oh, that thing is low damage. I'll leave it there. May have reach, but... Doesn't have damage potential. Also, we bombed so many apples out of this tree. Those are tufts of grass, not anything I can grab. I appear to have overshot, or is it up on top of this? It's probably up on top, which means we probably need to find our way around. It looks like this was indeed meant for after we got bombs. Or not. I was thinking that maybe they had required bombs to get to this shrine. But no, they required bombs to get more fire. Not that I'm complaining, those things seem potent. Yeah, it looks like this is indeed the way we are meant to go. I'm worried about our stamina. Will it hold out long enough? Is there a ledge? Looks like that might be a ledge. So let's head towards it. Ooh, that might have been a bad idea. But it might have been a good idea. Okay, it was a bad idea. Not nearly as bad as I expected, though. So, I mean, clearly I'm supposed to go somewhere from here. And apparently our stamina does last longer if we do not do any jumping. Which is a shame, because it's way slower to not do any jumping. Is there anywhere we can rest and regain our stamina? Looks like we're coming up to a horn here. Maybe if we get on top of that, we can rest a bit. If we can't, Link is going to have a bad time. Wait. Wait, wait. Oh. So until we cook it, we can't really do anything with it? Link, please. No! Ow. I don't think this is the right way. They make it so easy to die. They really shouldn't have such a long time between when you die and when you can hit A to continue. Okay. Saved when I got the chest. Um, yeah, how am I supposed to get up there? Am I supposed to get up there? I can't even look all the way up there. And I was accidentally holding the right stick. I'm glad I didn't walk off anything. I mean... Yeah, I, I feel... Oh, is there, is there a lower ledge? Or is there some other way I'm meant to come here? Let's... Zoom in here. Okay, so it is on top of a ledge. So is there a way for me to get there? Was that even where I was meant to go? I'm beginning to feel like it might have not been one of the shrines I was actually supposed to get to. But then again, maybe it is. So, are the River of the Dead and Mount Hylia considered to be part of the Great Plateau? 
I'm not certain. I imagine they are, considering the old man was there to teach us how to chop our way across here. Oh. What's... What are these bugs here for? They just here to flap around, or are they showing me a secret? Is this a secret? This doesn't seem very secret. Ooh, but I can stand here. Maybe this is the path. The path I meant to take. Nope. At least not that particular spot. Uh, let's... Okay, let's just not... Why are these butterflies here? Butterflies in Zelda games have often signified secrets. Is there something to look through the Sheikah slate at? No. Hmm. I feel like there's got to be a way up. Okay, there is very clearly ledges. There are very clearly ledges. Grammar, come on. So, going up the steeper face is apparently the solution here. Because it's got outcroppings. Like this one. This is definitely the way I'm meant to go. Okay, yeah. Not doing the jumps is certainly more stamina efficient. So what's a rush room? Uh, I want to find something that can function like a stamina fruit in Skyward Sword did. Just replenish my stamina all in one go. But I don't know whether... Whoops, wrong button. I don't know whether such a thing exists in this game. The reason I pressed the wrong button there is I'm used to jumping while climbing... Being B when I'm playing Monster Hunter. I don't know that I'm going to make this jump. Thank goodness Link can jump kind of through ledges. Otherwise, I would not have made that. Okay, let's just climb for now. There's our next stop. Sure is a rock climbing adventure. And let's just... There we go. And we can probably do some jumps to get up here. Yep. And thus, we come to the Oadaim Shrine. So this is indeed a place we were meant to be. Or so, I assume. I mean, it's an open world game. I guess everywhere is a place we're meant to be, but I think we're supposed to do these three shrines to get the paraglider, and then the world actually opens up. That's my guess. But that's going to be it for this episode. Join us next time when we actually go into this shrine. See you then, friends.